Hi. Oh, hi. How's it going? Not bad. What are you doing? I just reading the papers or I'm waiting. Is there any interesting news? Well, yeah, I was reading about some new research on physical fitness. How even little activity like fidgeting can make you fitter. Fidgeting, really? So every time I put a lot of move around my chair, I'll be made in shape. Yes, yeah, seriously, it apparently true. There was a research study on let me see where it grows. Oh yes, it would get a male planet in Minnesota. Anyway, they found all kind of minor everyday activity like standing up to stretcher, getting off the sofa to change the TV channel, and even fidgeting could make a difference between being thin or being overweight. Maybe I should throw away the remote. Well, maybe because if you have remote control, it keeps you from moving. They also find that overweight people are less likely to feature something people, and that overweight people spend at least two hours more each day just sitting still. And guess what? The extra activity of thinner people might make a difference of something like 10 to 30 pounds in weight per year. Wow, I better start featuring more. No, you don't have to worry about your weight. But don't some people just feature more? Some people seem like they're more nervous than others or something. Yeah, that's not a really interesting point from the research. They think some people may be born with a tendency to either be fidgety or not fidgety. So either you're born to move around a lot or you're not? That's kind of discouraging, isn't it? Well, you think so, but the lead researcher for the project says that he doesn't feel it is. He said that the good thing is that you don't necessarily have to go out and run 10 miles. Just any little movement or activity could contribute physical fitness. Okay, that's good to remember. I'm curious, did the article explain how to do the research? Yes, in fact it does. The people in the study were special clothes that had sensors on them. The sensor to measurement every half second. There were 20 people in the study and they wore special clothes for 24 hours a day for 10 days and they went about their daily routines. They found through the sensors that think people spend at least 100 feet more minutes moving in some way than the overweight people. That's so interesting. Hey, can I read the article? Of course, here you go. Wait, maybe I should stand up and shake before I read it. Maybe you should.